three, two, one. Okay, hey you guys. Let's catch into this reading, um, tarot card reading, intuitive reading for Peach McIntyre. Uh, one of the subscribers definitely told me that the last reading, um, Peach appears to be trying to get back with her husband. So let's just see what the cards say. Let's see what energy says. Um, as you all know, my readings are current energy. Um, so we'll see what happens. We'll see what spirit wants us to know. And um, we'll go from there. Okay. So when it comes to Peach McIntyre and her husband Wood and this um, kind of thing about divorce and things of that nature, spirit is just acknowledging that she is calculated okay um once she sees that something is picking up momentum she's going for it okay so whether they're getting back together behind closed doors or not if the storyline is a uh, hook line and sinker she's gonna she's gonna do what she needs to do to do what she needs to do okay spirit is acknowledging that by saying look with this cake it's all about it's a little something i threw together it's accomplishments it's layers on the cake spirit is acknowledging acknowledging that she needs to get grounded and at the heart of it she does want peace but she's using her situation like to profit off of i don't know how else to explain it um accomplishments triumph self-esteem confidence talent accolades and fame spirit is saying though subconsciously that she is running around like a chicken with her head cut off um she could have done um some type of magic um which kind of makes sense when you step back and you look at it um only because it's just a constant tug and war um in this relationship so it appears um but energetically you know um it feels like this could be the reaction you know the consequence of a, of a love spell um trying to hold on to something um trying to manifest something that is not a part of your path no matter what you do it just doesn't work it just doesn't fit it's like putting on a shoe that's too small or putting on a shoe that's too big that's just what i visually see okay so um we have the chicken which gives me brouhaha energy and this is why i said it this is in the area of love and again spirit is saying to get grounded um and then we have some water sign energy this could be emotional or water sign energy and it's just like again someone is doing something and then if you don't do what i say hankering down snapping off with your head not literal but it's like the snapping motion okay um hangering temptation at her intimacy proposal and a message of love and so that is the energy between the two spirit wants me to ask another question okay so how does um peach feel about wood current energy Thank you. Okay, she's saying it's right. Raining cats and dogs, temporary intensity. This too shall pass. Release, um, cleansing. But she's saying that she's going to use this for her for her better good. Like she's going to triumph. She's going to um, turn this into fame, accolades, talent, self esteem. She's going to make money off of it. Okay. Um, she's also acknowledging this card wants to come out um, that she is reaching out to her ancestors. Okay, so she's praying about it. And there is some brouhaha in there. There's some magic in here. Okay, um, sweating like a center of church. And then we go again okay it's just gonna keep doing what it does um because that is the energy that's coming through so there is an energy of her like reaching out to her ancestors uh, praying about it there's an energy of uh, communication honesty courage sharing revelation surprise news text and a phone call and this is in the area of love this is about happiness and wanting to be happy and everyday magic magic it's like catching a lightning bug something that you want to have so bad and you like running after it trying to catch it okay because it's a secret um, wish and a simple pleasure um, this has to do with hugs and kisses, adoration, snuggling, pillow talking, yellow, giving me that solar plexus energy. I can, I can. She's going after it, um, bonding in someone's favorite. But again, there's something in this situation that has someone sweating like a sinner in church. Get remorse, nerves, worry, confession, coming clean, apology, integrity if is needed. So if you are using it, this will make someone sweat like a sinner in church. But if the other person is not being completely faithful, that energy would um, result in this as well. Okay. But then again, we get the hankering, um, the temptation. If you don't do what I say, I'm going to get you, you know. And then again, it's sending you into a frenzy. It's sending you into a very overwhelmed, chaotic state of which you need to refocus and redo for best results okay that is what spirit is saying and you know how i am i'm 10 toes down with spirit this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes okay so when it comes to a uh, peach and wood there is this twin flame energy um and there is this true love energy um and there is this fun time so sometimes throwing one up in the air at a concert maybe um but let's just see what spirit says <sighs> Peach McIntyre and Wood. Peach McIntyre and Wood. Um, 
children. Lots of children are involved. Spirit is saying he's a young male. Like he's just young and immature is what is coming up. And she's coming off as a beauty queen. But she's also coming off um, like a wallflower. Like as much as you want to dance around and parade, there's just this part of your life where you're sitting back and then watching other people enjoy life. And there is light here shining upon her, um, but she doesn't look happy. Um, and it's something that she's going to be communicating more and more about not being happy, um, fully happy, okay? Peach McIntyre and Wood. What is Wood's real name? I don't know why Brian wants to pop out, but... Peach McIntyre and Wood. So intention is in the reverse. Intention is in reverse. 22. Are you clear about your intentions or are you in a foggy state of denial about your true motives and your amb ambitions? This is a time to set back, step back and gain perspective and clarity about your direction. Check your motives and ask, and ask, excuse me, if they are sincere. Are you pursuing some goal blindly without asking its cost? Good intentions are being misinterpreted. Now is the time for self-evaluation and self-nurturing. You will benefit greatly if you take time out to regroup. So not just one, but both. Because the reason behind all of this is not pure. It's not It's not balanced, spirit is saying. What does um, Peach McIntyre want to say to Wood? You're giving them everything you promised me. I can't picture you with someone else. I stalk your social media. Rip me out the plastic, which I'm acting brand new. Okay. Um, what does Wood want to say to <laughs> Peach McIntyre? What is Wood? Ooh, look at all this. Well, let's see. You're so cold, the silence is killing me. You broke my heart, so I broke yours. I'm ready now, but it's too late. You're gone. Please answer me. I have to talk to you. Okay, so there's something he want to talk about. All right. Peach McIntyre and Wood. We did get the infinity. There is unlimited potential. This is just saying that there's multiple possibilities. It's time to expand, avoid self-sabotage in this situation, this relationship, and that this is just an ongoing situation. It's going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And it's time for them to set some new challenging goals and break through any barriers. Um, it's time for them to kind of focus on the bigger picture. Um, and it's just a reminder to resist settling for less. Wow. Interesting. How does Wood currently see Peach McIntyre? Well, he sees her as the intellectual. Rationality, logic, critical thinking, brain power, mentality, thoughts, mindfulness, thoughts, senses, decisions, making, decision making, intelligence, calculated moves, intellect, conversing, mastermind, thinker, psychological effects, deep thinker, visualizations, judgment, head, reasoning, wizard. And how does Peach McIntyre currently see wood? Second time we see the word twin flame. She sees him as her twin flame. Twin flame union, reflection, bond, synchronicity, similarity, soul to soul connection, separation. The one, strong feelings, similar paths, sharing. Energy between... Um, Peach McIntyre and Wood. Thank you, Spirit. 
Um, so somebody is sick. <laughs> I'm just tell you how it came out through understanding. Sick of running away. Somebody is sick and tired of someone running away. Okay. Peach McIntyre and Wood. Current energy. Somebody's in the gym and they doing more than they should be in them long hours. Somebody's doing some other things to this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes. And somebody's just writing it out, writing out all this emotion. There's a lot of things. Every time I read on them, there's always something like that. Sarah says split the dick. What they really want this person to do is focus on family time. Okay. All right. Peach McIntyre and Wood Current Energy. Tower moment. They're going through a radical change, disaster, major loss, chaos, pain, and a natural disaster. Subconsciously, they're focusing on achieving their goals and entrepreneurship. Um, and in the middle of the deck, what they're not seeing is things are finally manifesting and growing with rewards, results, and patience. But they're definitely going through it right now. What is the overall outcome of Peach McIntyre filing for divorce? Current energy. Um, this is going to end in court. It's going to end in some kind of counseling so that they can follow the rules and share knowledge with each other um, to make it work. Subconsciously, it looks like they are going to stay together. A love, attraction, happy couple, mutual respect, compatibility, and balance. Um, but in the middle of the deck, they are going to continue to have issues with ego, sadness, and someone is overly confident because if you argue was in spell work, it will keep the person there, but there will always be problems because it just doesn't fit. It's just somebody else's um, manipulation to desiring the energy to stay. I mean, I don't know how else to say that. Um, what's next for Peach McIntyre and Wood? Um, there's going to be some overwhelming energy. There's indecision and emotional detachment. This will be talked about as petty gossip, patient, uh, so have patience. And there's going to be a lot of chattiness and curiosity, um, but the Queen of Swords, this air sign, who is very protective, is the mother. Um, she has a good sense of humor. She's open-minded. She controls it all, so it's not going to, it's not, I mean, she's going to control the narrative, whatever, whatever people are saying, the petty gossip, she's right here in the middle of it, and she is going to control it all she's going to handle it any anybody who's feeling overwhelmed with indecision and people start talking about it here she comes swooping in see the bird and she settles everything she clears it all out she's a thinker and she figures it all out quickly you know there's when it keeps saying manipulator mastermind thinker that is what he said. All right. This reading is alleged and for inter entertainment purposes. Now we sit back and let the universe do what the universe does. 